Yes, welcome everybody to Poketober. Oh my gosh. Yes, I'm so excited. It's, it's Pokemon. It's October. We're going to have a lot of fun. Uh, and we're starting the day. We're starting the month with this lovely, lovely game called Pokemon Infinite Fusions. Um, I'm going to turn the music down and the sound effects uh, just a little bit just because it was pretty loud in my ears. Uh, or also going to just mess around with some of these other settings. Oh, you can see my mouse. Uh-oh. <laughs> uh, my cursor. <laughs> uh leave that on quick surf uh we are actually going to change this to number seven in in light of halloween <laughs> uh and that should do it now we are going to make a new game i was ah lovely all right uh city pallet town trainer information yeah name to your name there we go all right we'll just do that weird uh yes yes there we go is this information correct yes a few moments later more info easy mode okay cool cool uh, let's set it to normal. Uh, game type. In reverse mode, all the fusions used by trainers are... F what? So, if a trainer normally has a Pikachu head, Bulbasaur body fusion. In normal mode, it will be a Bulbasaur head, Pikachu body. Okay, that's interesting. Huh. Eventually. So, I'm noticing a few things are already missing, so we're starting this off with a wonderful bang. This revolutionary new device extracts the DNA of two Pokemon that combines them to create entirely new species. Okay. <laughs> yes! You can actually chat now, uh, Dice. It's amazing. We fixed it. <laughs> So I'm not going to bother reading any of this until I actually get into my real game because it looks like some things uh, did not give me the right options. Because so I was told to do a challenge for this. Yes, 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 yes. Oh, oh, that's cool. Oh, I love that. <laughs> yes, hello, folks. Ah, uh, the music is too loud? Yeah, that's what I was afraid of. Okay. Uh, title screen. Yes. One eternity later. Uh, ah, here we go. This is what I was looking for. So we're actually going to do the randomized mode. Um... Wait, how do I... Oh, that's how. Okay, I guess max is 17. I am set. Is this information correct? Yes. Ah. Uh, welcome to Poketober, everybody, where we're actually getting things on the roll. Uh, yes, turn that on. Um. Custom sprites only. I'll leave that off. Starters, I will turn that on. Uh, static encounters. Uh, yeah, I'll turn that on. Gift Pokemon. Yeah, I'll turn that on. Fuse everything. Include Fuse Pokemon in the randomized pool for... Yeah, I will turn that on. All the one I'm leaving off is the custom sprites. Um, because... Um, uh, I don't want it to just be the custom sprites. Uh, I guess. I. Well, actually, no, I'll turn that on. I'll turn that on. We'll just turn it all on. We'll turn everything on. Uh, select randomizer options. Yes, let's turn that on. Uh, custom sprites only. Yeah, I'll turn that on. Actually, no, I'll turn that off. I want the chance to see some other stuff too. Ooh, you're, you're, you're hunting for the shiny Guzzlord? Oh, that's awesome. 
Custom sprites only. I'll leave that off. Jim Ta. <laughs> ah, no. No, I'm keeping that off. Uh, actually. Hmm. Nah, I'll turn it all on. Screw it. Except for that. Uh, let's see here. Uh, I was advised to leave the items off because if I turn that on, I will never be able to buy Pokeballs, ever. So I'm going to leave that alone. Confirm that. Uh, choose randomizer degrees of Pokemon. Um, give me some more info. Uh, Pokemon get shuffled according to their base stats. The lower the degree of the Pokemon will be replaced by other Pokemon with around the same game stats. Uh, the higher it is, the more they get randomized to do anything. Okay. What should I set for this, guys? Should I set it for custom? Insane? I don't know. Kind of leaning towards insane here. What do you guys think? Hmm. Balanced, moderate, or insane. Alright, I'm hearing insane, so that's what I'm going to do. Uh, choose randomizer degree. I will also set that to insane. Base stat range is 300 BS. Good to know. Okay. Yep. 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 Okay. Are these settings correct? Yes, these settings are in fact correct. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. <laughs> what have I done? Uh, yes, I do know the definition of insanity. It is doing the same thing over and 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 over again, expecting a different result. But, you know, you're getting the same result every time. That is the definition of insanity. And wow, that. That took a bit. <laughs> awesome. Uh, trainers have been shuffled. Perfect. All right, here we go. Let's get my mouse out of the way. Uh, I'm gonna set it to normal. Uh, yes, I would like auto saves on. Uh, yes, I would like to automatically download the missing sprites. Uh, you can modify various settings in the options menu at any time. Perfect. Uh, yeah, I'll skip the intro. Uh, rival's nickname. Mm. What should be the rival's nickname? Hmm. All right, you guys name the rival for me. Uh, let's see what you guys come up with. Meanwhile. Oh yeah, that's right. So, so guys, uh, I have a little buddy down in this corner right here. Actually, uh, his name is uh, Stubby. He, he is a beautiful boy. You know, he is a good boy. Oh, I guess he didn't want to be here for a second. Dang. Oh, well. <laughs> Marmalade is too sweet of a name for him. I agree. But yes, uh, I, have a, I have a little stubby here. He's my little buddy, Spirit Tome. He's a good boy. He, he He's an oddball. You know, he spins the other way to normal Spirit Tombs. But, you know, he, he does some, some really neat stuff, you know? Uh, if you guys, uh, you know would like to send a cheer our way or to, uh, you know, donate anything, then you might find that he's got something special for y'all. Who knows? Ugh. And yes, Idea Maker, you are right. Marmalade is uh, too sweet a name for him, so we'll have to find, we'll have to think of something else. So what, what is a much better name for him? We gotta think, guys. What should we do? Hmm, what should we name what should we name my rival? I don't know why. I he looks like a Nick. <laughs> oh shoot. Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna name him Nick. He seems like a Nick. So I'll name him Nick. There we go. Alright, uh, we'll put this safe slot in file A. 
Yep. Oh no, it is time for you to start on your journey. Yay. Oh, what is this? A, 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 a wardle? Guys, guys, look at the. It's a war. <laughs> it's a war turtle and a. Okay, I can already tell. This game is. This game is gonna give me all kinds of insanity. I can already tell. Oh my gods. Okay, um. Uh, I'm gonna go for no for now. Oh my god! <laughs> That's a starter? That is a starter? I'm not gonna lie, I, I may go with him. I kinda wanna see what the, the, the other one is though. Come on. Oh, hell no! What is that? What is that? What is this? Oh my god. No, no, oh my. Ah! It, 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 it's spooky. It's very spooky. <laughs> oh, John John style. <laughs> yeah, um. Jeez Louise, man. What is this? This is not okay. You know what? I, I, I'm tempted to go with him, though. I, I don't know. Oh. You're right, Faith. You are absolutely right. Tis the season to be spooky. But so was the other one. That one was a ghost type. This guy right here. Gor Gogarn. Gogron. Yeah. That's, that's, that's a ghost type right there. Oh. Okay, so my options are Wardle, Mr. Ledoux, or Gogron. Okay. <clears throat> Alright, you guys vote. You guys vote. One, two, or three. One being Mr. Ledoux, two being Wardle, and three being uh, Gogron. You guys get to pick. If you guys want me to go through it again, just let me know. A few moments later. Time's up. So, uh, Gogron it is. Gogron is going to be our starter. I want to say two, but I'm going to say... Okay. Unfortunately, Gogron still wins because we've got three votes for three and two votes for one. And if you wanted to vote two, that's perfectly fine. Uh, Mr. Ledoux is going to give me nightmares, but Gogron, I feel like, is going to be uh, what takes the cake on this. So, you, the people have chosen. Number three it is. Gogron is mine. Uh, should we give him a nickname? Should we give Gogron a nickname? I don't know. I kind of like Gogron. What do you guys think? Should we nickname him? If we are going to nickname him, what should his nickname be? You know, what do you guys think? I want you guys to help decide. I must nickname all Pokemon to bond with them. Yeah, I know that. So what is going to be Gogron's nickname? I don't know. I, I, I don't know it's typing yet either. I just picked it up, so... I could always nickname it later, but... I don't know. I want you guys to decide. Should If we're going to nickname him, what would his nickname be? I don't know. It's Halloween. Well, the month is Halloween. It's October, everybody. You know. We should probably do something Halloween-themed. We should probably do something intriguing. Something that harks fear into the hearts of all. Something terrifying. Something devastating. I mean, he does look like a devastating Pokemon.
death or Lucifer. You know what? Let's call him Lucy Doocy. <laughs> Lucy Doocy. He will strike fear into the hearts of his enemies. <laughs> uh, no, no. Not Lucy Doocy. Um... Hmm. Well, I mean, this is Pokemon Infinite Fusion. Huh. Eh? Godsifer? <laughs> yeah, we're, we're refusing Lucifer and God? Oh, I'm probably going to get so much hate mail from religious people from that. I'm sorry if I offend. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, you know what? I, I, I'm kind of sold on Godsifer. Screw it. Godsifer it is. You chose Gogrun, huh? I, in that case, I'll take this. Which one did he take? Oh, no. Oh, help me. Alright, which one did he pick? <laughs> oh, he took the Wardle! <laughs> he took the Wardle! <laughs> Alright, uh... Ooh. Okay. Right off the bat, he knows Mud Slap. That's a ground type. I'm assuming Wardle is a Bug Water type. So... Let me try Pound. Let's see what... Oh, okay. Astonish? Mud Slap. Okay. Nice. Nice! Oh, that's awesome. <laughs> okay! Alright! I'm digging this. Eight, I got 80 pounds for winning. Nice. Completely worthless. I'll find some... You heartless man. You heartless man. Uh, do me a favor. I need you to pick up a parcel at Viridian City's Pokemart for me. It's just down the road, but I forgot to pick it up earlier. Alright, cool. See you later, man. Da -da -da. And yes, I do have the auto run on. You know what? I might actually turn that off. Hold on. Default movement. There we go. That's better. That's better. Okay. So, what is the interact button? That is my question. Alright. Route 1. I don't have any Pokeballs on me. Oh. All right, let's see what we get. I'm sorry, what? I'm so confused. Spirit, <laughs> 